purpose of this trip, what these patients and families and volunteers do, is they put a human face on a public policy issue. That looks like a, like a line on a spreadsheet. But when they meet with a family, with a person that has suffered through cancer and, and beat cancer, that puts a human face, a dramatic uh, picture of a Florida family that's faced this issue. And that's unforgettable. So when the legislator goes to make a decision about cancer funding, about cancer research, they link it to the experience they've had with our volunteers talking to them. Yeah, I want to share my story. I want to talk about what my wife has gone through, what I'm going through, and what other individuals who will be with us that day are sharing. So hopefully they'll understand how important this organization, this hospital is to the community, to the state, and to the nation. For the past 12 years, I've been a cancer patient. I've had four different kinds of cancer. And because of the advances in cancer research, I'm here today. I am a melanoma patient. And my wife passed away two years ago from 22 years of breast cancer. Towards the end of her life, uh, we came to uh, Moffitt, and uh, she asked me uh, just before she passed away to spend the rest of my life helping others. And I said, where? And it took her about five seconds to say Moffitt, because they took such much better care of me than all the other cancer facilities that we went to. Uh, my wife is battling the, the gynecological cancer, which is uh, the silent killer for women. She's pretty proud of me, I have to say. Uh, she, she gave me a big kiss this morning, wished me well, and uh, she, she thanked me numerous times. And I told her next year she's going to be with me on this trip. Mm -hmm.